Welcome to the first TT News video of 2017, brought to you by SD Sport. January saw the return of the ITTF World Tour, with the Hungarian Open being hosted in Budapest, which turned out to be a positive tournament for Chinese players. So, without further delay, let's get into January's TT News. China has decided to lift the international suspension of Liu Shiwen after women's coach Kong Linghui confirms the news earlier in the month. Liu was banned from representing her country at the back end of 2016 after she refused to play at the 2016 Women's World Cup due to illness. But coach Kong Linghui has decided that enough time has passed since then, and the world number two is now available for selection. We stay with the subject of China, as all four of the senior titles on offer at the 2017 Hungarian Open went to players representing the Asian nation. Chen Xingtong came out on top against fellow compatriot Wen Jia in the women's singles final, while the men's singles gold medal went to Yan An who beat Shang Kun on his return to the ITTF World Tour stage. The two doubles trophies also went to Chinese competitors, with Fang Bo and Zhu Yu defeating Brazil's Hugo Calderano and Gustavo Tsuboi to take the men's doubles title, and the partnership of Chen Xingtong and Li Jiayi sealed the women's doubles crown, following their victory over Hungary's Georgina Pota and Sweden's Matilda Ekholm. The World Championships of Ping Pong title has been won by an Asian player for the first time ever after Yan Huai Hao captured the trophy at Alexandra Palace in London. China's Yan recovered from a game down to beat German player Alexander Fleming by a 3-1 scoreline in the final, while the 2015 and 2016 champion Andrew Bagley exited in the last 16. If you want more from the world of table tennis, then head over to our website at sdsports.co.uk and why not check out our social media pages on Facebook, Twitter and Google+. Also, if you enjoyed watching this video and want to keep up to date with the world of table tennis, then please hit the subscribe button now. Join us again for the next TT News video. Thank you.